Hello everybody, welcome back to Bellatra's Road to 100%. We still need to unlock this deck by winning at the orange stake. I had been climbing the stakes through blue, but I think plasma might be the fastest way to ascend through the stakes. So we'll go on red blind today. And if we can be reasonably quick about it, maybe we'll squeeze in two bl uh, blind colors today. But let's see, first of all, can we find a decent hand here? There's the 10 I was looking for and not granted. Oh, come on, there's another 10. And what will this uncommon joker be? That's the big question. So on red stake, we don't get rewards from small blinds, so more inclined to skip them. Retrigger all cards played for the next 10 hands. Well, I'm not going to not take it. Even if it just means we get a bunch of extra chips for some hands here. Show me aces and sixes. There's the six. There's the aces. So on Plasma Deck, this is actually really good. It's just loads of extra chip value. Uh, but 3xing for straights. Straights can be hard to make, but if we can do it, more power to us. 2, 3, 4, 5. Just needs an ace or a 6. Just needs an ace or a 6. Now the ace will score more chips than the 6 will after everything triggers twice as well. Now the problem is we've got no mult to multiply. So we're not getting a whole lot just in chips right now. Can't afford either of those, but this is fine. And that is something to fuel abstract at the very least. Show me... Actually, 9, 10, Jack, Queen. You want me to discard aces, so show me a king or an eight. Much better. That's not going to work for our straights, unfortunately. This I will gather up immediately. Um, holographic is not as good as chips are in this particular situation. No straights here at all. You want me to discard sixes. I've got no sixes either. So I'll just play two pair. There's the six. No aces to make the low end of the straight. Four hands left there. Yeah, we need some big chip jokers or something. That is a pretty big little chip joker. So this joker gains eight chips when each played two is scored. Our deck currently just has the standard four twos, but we will try and make that work, certainly, especially as they will re-trigger for a second. So we have two, three, four, five, six. I would love to find other twos first. You want me to discard queens? All right, we find a two. So that got double upgraded, which you love to see. Thank you, Salsa. So already this guy up to plus 42. We got another two. And then we have a diamond flush to finish. 
Seltzer is dead. We got no 10 for the straight. Don't think we're going to need it right now. So, we want... Oh, there you go. That's grand. So, if we don't do anything else, this is 120 chips. So, even without the order impacting us there, we are just fine. Uh, I will take a Fool. I will take an Arcana pack. Can I death a two? I can't death a two. I can strengthen Ace, though. Which is not bad going. And, you know what? We'll make a Queen into a King as well. So, that's an extra two. It's the only instance where Aces do wrap around to two. I'm just going to play this. 10,000 points. You want fours gone. Well, I want to see more of the twos I've made. But we can't all get what we want, can we? I will... Take that. I don't know that Blackboard is incredible right now. It's probably better than Mail and Rebate, to be fair. And it might be better than the order, all things considered. Yes, we are going to take our Deuce of Hearts and make two more of them. I think it was Deuce of Hearts, Deuce of Diamonds, so neither mattered for Blackboard's sake. One in seven cards drawn face down. We'll keep this three. So that might be a two. Queen Jack, ten, nine, eight. No more extra deuces here right now. I'm going to keep one discard for Banner's sake. Strong stuff. Let's make the uh hmm. I'm likely to play these, so let's make red stuff into black cards. Do things that way around. And you know what? These kings are now also aces, so we have five aces, seven deuces. Extra large blind coming up. One to be very aware of. I think this is a great time. Fifteen thousand. With the king in hand, we can't get blackboard to go, but we can get the order to go, which is about as good. No strength. So let's just go to... How many clubs and spades do we have? 16 spades, 13 clubs. And this is much of a muchness, but more black cards equals better, right now at least. Let's make 
the bigger cards are worth more chips. Eh, that's probably a mistake. I think I'm okay with the wall. We could re-roll it, but I think I'm okay with it. What I would like to see is another two. There it is. What do you have in you? The world. We'll save that for the boss encounter. That's half of what we needed. That's probably still worth playing. And this will be the last 500 points we need. Okay. Anything really good in here for us? Absolutely not. Um, I will level up straights because the value then gets multiplied by the order when we play those straights. And here... Oh, this is going to have not that in it anymore. Fine. We'll just go all in on straights. I don't want to use my discards because banner's value is worth so much to us. So, do we start here? Two pair with blackboard. Two deuces and all of banner. Okay, do we have a straight here? No, no seven, no queen, no two. Do we have a flush? Yes. I will take the flush. Thirty-eight thousand for that. And a decent straight with all black cards remaining in hand. Oh yeah, straights go wild. Straights are huge. This can get rid of some red cards. This can make some black cards. All heart cards are debuff. Fine by me. Go back to rank sorting. Show me a five. Well, for 25,000 for a random pair, I think we can dig for deuces. Great stuff. This is now 170 chips. Uh, erosion's worth nothing. Can't afford Mega Buffoon Pack. I suspect this is a good chunk of points for us. 33,000 is half of what I wanted. Got another two there for me. I want to balance using hands played versus hands discard for banners benefit. And that's some more Wii Joker value. Hack would go huge right now, but that's another story. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, okay. Well, now what do I do? Do we ditch the order? We ditch the order for hack? Okay. Um... Let's invest in some full house then as well. And you know what? Flush also. Heart cards are debuffed. Twelve 
28,000 for that. Um, I need an ace or a six. Actually, no, I would rather just find a full house, wouldn't I? Wow, you don't want to give it to me, do you? I could just play trips and then play this straight, although we don't have... We don't have order anymore. But we don't need it. <laughs> You're not discovered yet, and I would love to discover you, but I can't really afford you anyway, so can't be too mad. Base chips and malt are halved. Blackboard, showing strong. This guy up to 250 chips now. Uh, ramen, 2x. I don't think we really need it, honestly. This is giving us 15. Everything else is giving us chips, so it doesn't really work out. Don't want red cards. We'll take money. Anything incredible here? No. Sure, I'll take Plank Voucher. What's the worst that can happen? Um. Keep the pair of nines. Play the flush we have given. We have enough value in hand that I'm comfortable spending some discards to look for some twos. We don't find them. So we just play that instead. Plus 10. Plus 10 on high card is not really much of anything. No aces. So, you know what? Here's a glass too, because it will trigger twice and we can use it in the finale. There or thereabouts. Fifty K. Um, I think I need an eight or a king. Stuff. Still can use Hangman to get rid of red cards in an emergency. Still don't know really what I'm looking for, but maybe we'll know when we find it. Very large blind. Okay. So we want to find that glass two in the finale. I was hoping... I mean, I could just play a pair and then play something else after if I have to. Which I won't have to here. This is now 298 chips. Level up full house. Show me some more glass or something. Yes. Uh, you have earth in you. Do I have any? Yeah, I have threes and fours. They will trigger twice on hack. Are we on small blind, big blind, big blind coming up? Okay. Great start for us. Half the points we need. Now, we're not going to get blackboard here, but I don't want to screw around with these. And it was still 91,000. 
plus 50 chips. This is plus 15 times 3 is 45 divided in half. So this is actually more than this is, I do believe. And it offers us the opportunity to make tarot cards during the finale. Okay, lots of pairs, lots of spades. We have a glass four and a glass two, so I want to keep the fours and the twos. So I guess I'm going to awkwardly play two pair here and see what we get out of Vagabond. The tower is interesting. This is great to see. What I'm actually going to do right now is this and this. Wow, that was not as many points as I wanted it to be. Good grief. Okay. We still have a glass four in the deck. But wow, that was not what I wanted to see. We have one hand left. I can make these nines into tens. I can make this three into a four. Um, but I really need to find the glass four that isn't here. Even then, a full house is gonna be best. But every time I discard, I lose value to banner being worse. And they are not going to give me Oh, there's the glass four I wanted. Quads. Huh? But this is not going to be a 350,000 point quads. Damn! Violet Vessel wrecked me. Alright, well, we said we go twice. I was just hoping for two wins, but these things happen. Foil card is an absolute must. All clubs are debuffed. We've got nines and eights and fives. All of them with a club. So, foil joker immediately is lush. Of course it's an egg. Right, it's not going to do anything yet, but you have to take Brainstorm. Uh, Retrigger all played face cards. Diamonds give more malt. We don't have hack, so. But retriggering face cards is more chips, which I think is the important part. And that is compatible with that. So we're on a face card run. So these two will trigger three times for plus 30 chips apiece. Which seems good to me. Uh, 
I will take... No, I won't take photograph. Can't afford it. What I really want... Well, tower is good. But what I really want is to put some more chips on... Those face cards. Now, here we can do... Uh, do I want two emperors or two death... Do I want an extra emperor or an extra death card? Is the big question right now. I think I'm just going to double death. Then all of these jacks will trigger twice. So if we can put some extra malt or preferably some extra chips on those, we're laughing. The tower is more chips in stone cards. All face cards are drawn face down. Well, I would love to just play five face cards together, because then at least there's a pair in there. Or, you know what? This will probably be okay. Obviously, we run the risk of running into boss blinds that give us problems in that realm. Plus three hands. I'm just going to take the minor that stuff and scope for money. An uncommon foil joker. I don't think we'll be able to afford it, but I'll try. I mean, we have an egg that we can get rid of if it's really good. Wow, that wasn't enough. Good grief. So the egg's on $15. That is incredibly good. $8. Um, I'd actually sell popcorn and keep egg. Or would I sell satellite? No, we sell popcorn. So we just need to discard whatever it says and stack up those chips. So right now, just discard any spade that we find. Four thousand points for that. Um, nine chips, retriggle face cards. I think. Excuse me. I think this will be enough points, especially with the extra fifty here, fifty there. Yeah. Diamonds next round. Discarding diamonds. Well, lacking any other diamonds, we will just do this. So this needs to be at about plus 30 before it's worth more than this. Ah, Wee Joker is back. Tribe is here. Okay. Things got real, real spicy. This has loads of money in it thanks to Egg. So I'm going to take it because we're very poor. 
Polychrome 4, you simply do not say no to, and a king with extra chips on it is something I did want to see. Do I see myself playing big flushes? Not really. Not really. Here's magic trick. We can now find regular cards in the shop. Blackboard's back as well. Odd Todd is too good not to take. And I think it's better than Sock and Buskin. By far. Play only one hand. You want me to discard spades? Unfortunately, we're just going to discard what we get. Ah, oh, now none of this is odd. Which is a problem. All face cards. Um, I can discard three spades. And I can discard... Well, the sevens are odd, so... 27 chips, 60 chips twice. We do it this way. So all of that face card hunting is unnecessary now. We can make a wild card for castle. I'm just going to take two other things that we don't have here. Strength and Tower are great. Um, I would love to get a banana destroyed. But I'm not convinced it's better than the 50 chips on the egg. Guarding spades, and I would love to find extra aces. Yeah, this is compatible with this, but not the increasing. It just copies whatever number it gets to. Oh my god, throwback is also incredibly interesting. It's 2x malt, but all of our malt is tiny. And we want to make big numbers that get averaged. So big, tiny malt getting more tiny is not that helpful, I don't think. Um, another strength card. We've got two more aces we can find. We also have even cards we can turn into odd things. Uh, okay, the polychrome four. Both these fours are going to turn into fives. Oh, no. Are you going to turn into a polychrome stone card? Because you can be a polychrome stone card. Stones are worth 50. Are you going to be a polychrome stone card? And then I'm going to make three of you. So that's something we now have. You want me to discard spades? Happily. Ten thousand there. Eleven thousand there. We don't have banner, so we don't have to be super precious about our discards. Ah, oh, where were you when we had Sock and Buskin earlier? We have... Oh, we do have one other stone card. Hearts are debuffed. You want me to discard spades? 
But how about a pair of nines with three stone cards, two of which are polychrome? The polychrome's not doing much, I must say. Um, permanently give every played card plus four chips when scored is also really interesting. Is it too late? Like, how many cards would we have to play over and over and over again to make pie could be worth more value than egg is? You know? Well... i do that. And I get to choose two here. That's one. Forty-eight dollars out of this is two. Give me more hand size. Give me glass cards. Every played card permanently gains four chips when scored. I think it's just too late for it, unfortunately. You want me to discard clubs this time? Well... I suppose we can look for something else to go with our twos. Odd Todd, still the better play here. But we must keep an eye out on when it's no longer the best option. And I think now this is the best option. Unless we're playing more than three odd cards. And banners back too. I'm, I'm going to leave banner. Banner's only going to annoy me when I screw up how many discards we have left and whatnot. Alright, you want me to discard clubs. Okay. Let's start here. Got the job done. Just barely. Oh, hello, Arrowhead. Played cards with spade suit give plus 50 chips. We have 13 spades. What do we get rid of? Egg. Just too, too big. No spade making here. could put 30 extra chips on some odd stuff, but I just want to find spade makers now. I will keep up with the full house. Six of clubs. Hierophant is going to be better than judgment. First hand is drawn face down. Let's play the five cards on the right. There might be stone cards or deuces. Reckon this is a straight. It was not. What do you want discarded right now? Hearts. Fine. Although a pair of jacks is something. Alright, we're slowly working up to more spades over here. Thank you. 
Yeah, spade flush is kind of a big deal. Kind of a big deal. Um, uh, I want all of you, and I cannot have you all, so I'm just going to have to pass it by. Cards played previously, this anti are debuffed. All the more reason to skip it all. I will play these hearts while they're in front of me. Wait for the spades to come in. I'm going to hold Paraphon until the spades that we have against the final boss. Hopefully it's not a very large blind again. Create a copy of a random joker, destroy all other jokers. This is already copying this, so there's no need to just destroy everything else in the middle. None of this is great. I should have taken the discount before buying all of this stuff. Absolutely. Oh, I should have got the flush value as well. Sorry, I'm just out here being very bad at video game. Of course, there's one card to always be selected I can work with. Hearts. Fine by me. Play the stone card. Does us no harm. If I'm not playing spades, I should put something stronger on the left. Wow, you really don't want to give me more spades. I would prefer not to play my glass at this time. But I will. Oh no, I'm not going to have to. We're just going to score enough points with other cards. Here is another glass spade. Then we can make another glass card there. Will I just skip this and get to it? I think so. Was is one card to always be selected. Jack becomes wild instead of steel. And we play this immediately. We are just dandy. Alright, we hunt in endless just for any unlocks we don't already have. I need to buy, like, a bunch of cards from the shop to unlock something down the line. You're now glass. And... Those are not the things I want. That's not bad. Show me some more Emperor. No. Alright, just lots of glass spades. Yeah. 
88,000. Another 80,000. Pair of 10's probably good for 50k. Indeed. Not much in the way of cash, but that's fine. So let's go to our collection here. Vouchers. This guy. Buy 20 playing cards in the shop. I have now bought five in total. gonna need those spades aren't we but i will take this with three deuces to play all right we get by without needing the giant spade flush for now Full house has actually gotten pretty large. Rare, uncommon, common, uncommon, rare. I don't think with our current multiplier situation that becomes worth it, unfortunately. Lose one dollar per card played. Twos, fives, nines. Let's level up that full house some more then. 178. 90, 123. We Joker, the obvious answer. 200,000. Then we have a bunch of spades. Um, 194, 250. Good. That'll probably be the last one we get through. But we do get the chance to buy one more card. Temperance? No temperance. One point two million. Got any jokers I've never seen before? Nope. Base multipliers on a full house could do a little bit for us, but not as much as any of that. All right, unless we get some really, really big flushes going, I don't know that we're going to see what we want to see here. hoping to find other glass cards. We've got a glass six hiding out there somewhere. What I would like to play is a full house with glass sixes But it looks like that's not going to happen. There's no way this is a 2 million point flush. But that's okay. So we have gained another deck sticker. We've unlocked green stake on the plasma deck. And we... Did we discover something else? We did something? Oh, we uh, made progress towards this guy. Six of 20 now. We've not discovered that yet. We need to reduce hand size down to five cards for that. That's going to be a hoot. 
redeem at least 10 voucher cards in one run. That will also be a hoot. All right, we've still got lots of work ahead of us, but for now, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed the series, please do consider subscribing or hitting that like button. If you have any questions, comments, recommendations, put them down below. Otherwise, I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.